podcast. That's what, you know? that's what <laughs> I'm with that. About. I'm with that. All right, but speaking of which, now, first thing we got to see is Wadi versus Nine Super Pie. Honestly, excited. Uh, we saw Wadi last week. He actually took a loss against Jake, and that was a pretty unfortunate loss against uh, Steve. But this one against Wii Fit Trainer. Always excited to see uh, these Wii Fit uh, one tricks go at it and see what kind of tech they create. Yep. Um, ironically enough, Wadi used to use Wii Fit. Of course, Rob is always in the main, Rob Mewtwo. Um, but Wii Fit, there was a time where Wadi was going Wii Fit and winning events with it. So we'd be really surprised if Wadi's caught off guard by some of the tricks that Wii Fit has. Yeah, see, Wadi just barely screwed around that spike. I gotta say, Wii Fit Trainer's uh, spike is has to be one of the longest lasting in this game. It just stays out. Honestly, I'm pretty, honestly, pretty surprised to see that Nine Super Pie isn't doing too hot against Wadi. I think Wadi seems pretty experienced in this matchup so Ooh. far. You know, not really going for all these ledge planking, or usually what we see a lot from Wii Fit, Wii Fit trainers. Honestly, from Nine Super Pie, it looks like he's just down a box and get up real up close and personal. Yeah, um, it's a dangerous game. In theory, that sounds good as Wii Fit, but Rob, someone with frame data that's that good between the jabs and the tilts, and how are you going to deal with the nair? You might want to slow it down a bit. Maybe stay right outside the attack range and kind of let Wadi swing first and you swing second. Unfortunately, drop the shield here. Trying to go for those deep breathings, but unfortunately, right now, deep breathing isn't that good to just kind of quick cast for yourself. Take too much time. But uh, yeah, Wadi's looking pretty good, 96% so far. Are you looking to take the second stock from Knight Super Pie? Yes, kind of answer back ASAP if he wants to kind of contest against one of the big people from MDBA. Definitely. I mean, in a good position, you know, you're already guaranteed top five. All you have to do is essentially beat Wadi. It's looking difficult at the moment, but it's definitely doable. Ooh, free kill. Wadi saying, you know what? Here is a stock on the platter. All you have to do is finish your play. Oh, wait, part two. Are we going to see double spike? Ooh, okay. Oh, no, it doesn't go out there. Our road is a lot of shield damage. I don't know if y'all know that. Almost about to break it, but... Um, Ooh, that DI? Oh, oh no way! <laughs> How do you DI that then die to the pebble? <laughs> oh. Dang. But uh, kudos to Wadi. You know, there's a lot of players in that scenario who kind of put their controller down, take a deep breath. Wadi said, no, I, I, I wait until I see the blast on explosion. Yeah, we fit. you can do all the deep breathing. It's fine. I'm, I'm going to actually just shoot you and you will die. It works out, man. I mean, honestly, something that can definitely oh, answer. Oh, I mean, arm rotor off the dang left's blast zone? All right, Wadi. I think we all see you. I think he wants revenge from last week, guys. I don't know. Did the soccer think, ball uh, hit, hit, hit we hit all the way out? Too. You know? Yeah, it back, too, man. Like, my God. He made the biggest call out, and uh, he got his pizza. Dang. I mean... I hope the toppings were good. I don't know. <laughs> oh, there's Chicago, a you get sausage from everywhere else. You get pepperoni. Um, I That's do pepperoni or bacon, no matter where I go. It just doesn't uh, matter. If you're from Canada, it's Hawaii. You get syrup. Uh, no, no. If it's Canada, <laughs> you do pineapple and ham. Because surprisingly, Hawaiian pizza originated from Canada. I don't know. What Fun fact. Well, one that's ironic. <laughs> Just like, yo, yeah. <laughs> Hawaiian are like, yo, have Fun you been fact. to Canada? Good. We started something called Hawaiian pizza. <laughs> um, I'm surprised it's not maple syrup. They, they put it on everything else. I, You know what? I'm surprised too. I should talk to one of my Canadian friends about that. It's like, I thought, I thought you guys would want maple syrup to get kind yeah. of that, you know, sweet maple syrup glazed ham on your pizza, but looks like they want that pineapple. Yeah, much better start for Nine Super Pie this time around. But of course, Wadi finding an opening, making it count. But Nine Super Pie not going down without a fight. 83 to 46 percent, great position to be in. They definitely a change right now from Nine Super Pie in this second match. Are you playing a little more campy? Not really walking up and getting stuff close and personal. Trying to make sure he maintains the center stage as well. There are a lot more projectiles, man, and I like this kind of game plan. Yeah, Wadi needs to be careful. Um. No one can convince me otherwise. Right now, Wii Fit has limit. Okay, that is Smash 4 limit on deck. Do you see how far that tilt went? <laughs> uh, but how do you finish your plate? Yes, Wadi's at 138%, but without deep breathing, it's so difficult to kill his Wii Fit. Unfortunately, uh, Rob's a little heavy. Let's do a little bit more damage to go through. But 
Was he gonna do an on roader like that? Gonna get a was free that punch that back air. I, I almost want to say either that was desperation or that was a mistake. Um, that was a very unorthodox option to see in that position. But uh, nine super pie all over. Saying, you know what? <laughs> We're in the top five, baby. Okay, we don't let that rock. Not for free. Tokopera isn't going to kill just yet from Wadi. That was a big brain play. <laughs> Nine super pies that actually hit me up there so I can get deep breathing. <laughs> wow. Good mash outside of, the, outside of being grounded too. Gets out of dodge. Not getting hit up by the up tilt or the up smash from Wadi, so. Super pie. Doesn't get hit by the super laser. Throwing the sun salutation out. Ooh, okay. Ooh, okay. This should do it. Yep, free. Clean, easy. You are 85% though. Um, not the best position. You are off stage now as well. Really, one strong smash attack should be able to take it. Maybe even a back air. Should be. Oh, that was so that, smart. That Over there, looking at the soccer ball, not even, not even seeing the hands, not watching the pose. Oh, not again. Really enjoying seeing Wada just go for these, you know, plays, just throwing them off the ledge, just saying, all right, I know that you do not, you have a pretty linear recovery, so just, that's about the best way that we can get a stock this early. Otherwise, it's going to be a lot harder to find this stock and make this comeback. Yeah, it's still looking hard. You know, already lapped in percentage. Yeah. Um, and unfortunately for Wadi, you know, that that throw to up air conversion or to up tilt up, up air isn't really enough. Um, Nine Super Pie's DI is just so good that that's not a kill option. Right now, Wadi kind of in a desperation position. He did this last set too, where he actually good made call. a gigantic comeback against Ike. And we see him calling out the jump from Super Pie up in the air. So good stuff from him. Wadi has been in these clutch situations, ladies and gentlemen. You know, he he did a reverse three stock against, uh, against Ike last set. He could definitely look to do so again. And this is where we see a lot of the players kind of get, they kind of clench up, they kind of get nervous. That's who probably can kind of close it out. 123, he definitely can if he could just get the right call out. Yeah, Wadi's definitely a player that uh, honestly strives and that I don't see Wadi getting nervous all that often, if, no. you know, ever, I would say. So this is definitely a point where Wadi's going to be feeling really good and Knight Superpower, you're seeing that percent rack up and you got to think to yourself, you got to get this stock right now. The dash attack almost doing it. Yeah, Wadi's a player that uh, makes you nervous when he's at high percent. <laughs> yeah, he's at max rage. I mean, this is where you have to be very scared. If I'm Super Pie, I'm nervous as heck. I mean, you, you take a look at his playstyle, man. He's trying oh. to just go in and out, put the forward tilt. It's gonna knock him up. What was that hitbox? <laughs> what was that hitbox? They make no sense. They actually make no sense. Oh my God. Um, I, I think uh, Wii Fit has like the funniest hitboxes. Things get knocked forward, things get knocked up, things get knocked away because of all the yoga poses and all the stretches, you know? And uh, finally takes the second game in this set. Gets it up. Yeah, it actually looks like that was the first game that Nine Super Pie lost this entire tournament so far. Or the first game. So Wadi should be feeling pretty good, but now Nine Super Pie says, okay, you know what? You took a game. You took one game. Is that going to be the only game anyone takes? That's what we're going to find out. So where are y'all thinking stages? Mm. Honestly, oh. it's Wadi's choice, right? So mm. personally, if I'm Wadi, right? You win, you've been winning boxing. You've been winning up close and personal. Choose small stage. You get to go to Smashville. You know, maybe Battlefield's okay too. FD could be okay as well. Something that makes sure that you're able to kind of just close the distance. Yoshi's, Yoshi's story can be good too. So, okay. I was thinking something with platforms would have been a move. Um, just because when deep breathing is on deck, you do want to kind of just run away. Let it uh, clear out. But why do you wanting to go to Jeez. Final Destination? And right now, this might be why 76%. Oh, miss it. Yeah. Oh, that I, say, I think this makes sense. Nine Super Pie's been doing a really good job of just mixing up, you know, are you going to land on the platforms or are you going to land on the edge of the stage? Wadi's been holding center stage for what I would say is most of the set with Nine Super Pie honestly taking up on the ledge, which puts Wadi in a position of, okay, trying to call out how are you going to get center stage and you got to land after you spend that double jump. Nine Super Pie losing the first stock. Wadi feeling good, but percent is rising fast. I forgot that move existed. You never see a red beam come out of Rob unless it's a neutral beam. Um, really fantastic, just awareness of Wadi right there. 
to recognize all the resources were gone and the only position Nine Super Pie could actually land in. I love but, this. You know, FD kind of makes everything be solely focused on the neutral. And you see both of them just throwing a lot of projectiles to go in and out of this fight. Wadi, of course, taking a little bit better at that kind of situation, forcing Super Pie to be offstage for the time. But take a look, man. They both are just trading all these projectiles left and right. Yeah, yeah it's so unfortunate for Wii Fit. It's just the neutral B gets eaten by the gyro. Just if you hit the gyro at all, then it's just your neutral B's gone. All right, good hit, good hit, good stock. Now dead even, well dead even in stocks. So a huge percent difference. But that's the thing that Wii Fit can do. When you got the deep breathing on. Sure, it kills fast, but it also racks up damage. Crazy. You can find seventy percent in just a few hit combos. We might see it right now. It was the beginning of something, but unfortunately, only ending up at forty-two percent. Fantastic match out right there, and the air dodge, but how are you going to recover? Apparently, just soccer ball your way to victory. Oh, Scary. Whoa. Good! Whoa. Good Whoa. drag down. Wow. I shoot the air, air dodge into it, but still, that was just yeah. such a panic for Mind Super Pie. Yeah, but this is where Wadi can now build a lot of momentum. When you're down at last stock, it's so hard to come back, especially against someone that you know has had a lot of experience in the scene, and Super Pie has to make a gigantic comeback now. 106. This is game three. All the marbles, all the soccer balls, all the balls in the freaking kit of what Wii Fit has. Let's see yeah. if we can get all of it, man. Don't forget so the much damage from these projectiles. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, I thought the soccer ball was going to hit again. That was going to be so pretty to watch. All right, you're racking up all the percent in the world. It does not matter if you cannot take this stock. That was the biggest bait. Why he was trying to... Oh, and it didn't even matter. Oh. Not Super Pie with the patience of a god. We saw that again. We saw it again, man. f Toe just knocks him straight up for some reason. That's the move. That's that's Kinda the that's janky. the flavor of the month. Apparently. Yeah. Kind of swatting that medicine ball. Ooh, that was I really love that fun. aggressive option to come back yeah. from ledge. That was beautiful. Still making it back in. More aggression. <gasps> Ooh, 72% okay. because of it. I love what Nine Super is doing though, but <gasps> the down air is gonna push it back up in the ceiling! And Supai is gonna lose his life. Give that pie over to Wadi. Let's just take it, unfortunately. And a Wadi event sport. Yeah, but Chris Superpie, I think he played really well overall this entire set, so good job on him. Yeah, no, that was a such such a good set, seeing you know, both of them adapt to each other. Very, very fun. Especially the fact that Nine Superpie almost came back from what seemed like a pretty definitive first stock in that game yeah. three. But hey, we're going to see Wadi in uh, winner's finals of an MDVA, well, MDVA event, kind of. Now it's whole all of North America. Still hard for me to wrap my head around, you know, it's just like... Xanadu? Worldwide? No. Looking We're claiming like everyone's MDVA right now, whatever. L looking like a pit bull out here. You know, Mr. <laughs> Worldwide is what VGBC is going to be. But uh, that means that... Uh, we got the we'll world be... tour. Yeah, I'm down for it. <laughs> we doing it. Um, right. But yeah, we have a... Jake.